Hi gals, it's Patty. And thanks to Dee over at DK Crafts, we, um, my friend and I went over to Tuesday morning yesterday and we had a blast. Thanks Dee. I wanted to show you some of the things that I found. I found these gifts bags, aren't those gorgeous? It's even got some blingy design on it. And the, I got two of these because I am making baby blankets for a couple friends. This is a real pale pink. Um, and both of them will be pink because they both had girls. <laughs> um, and then I found a gift bag because one of my nieces is having a little boy. Is that not cute? And this is um, chipboard on the front so she can even take that off and put it in his album for him. <laughs> I love that. Just love it, love it. Okay, some of the other things that I found, and I'm going to make um, cards with this. I didn't even take this out to see what it is. There is an acrylic block in here. It's like the whole kit. The whole kit and caboodle. Let's look. Oh, it's in another package. Okay, there's stickers. There are stamps. Um, there are 30 baby toy stamps. 30 stamps. That is amazing. This is from Clear Choice Stamps. And that was, um, again, from Tuesday morning. And I was just going to look to see. I love the way they price things. The regular price was $14.99, sale price $13.99, their price $3.99, and they had knocked it down to $2.99. Thanks, D. I got this for a buck and a half. <laughs> I just love it. We had so much fun. I found some Prima flowers, and she, my friend Deb that went with me asked me, well, what, what is it you're going to do with those? And I said, well, you know, we're going to use the flowers, but I said this tin is perfect to turn it into a pin cushion for on my desk. I love it! Yay! Found some floral embellishments. And I've already used one of these, and I'll show you in a minute what I used it on. And then there is this gorgeous, I don't know if you can see this. Maybe I can get it out of here quick. It is a beautiful brooch, and at one time I was thinking about collecting brooches because I have one that was um, an aunt's that passed away and a grandmother's brooch, and I just think this is absolutely gorgeous. So I'm not sure if that'll just stay in my collection or if that will actually make it to um, the front of an album maybe or something like that. And then I found this little guy and he's going to become um, one of my pets at home. I found a hedgehog the other day and got that, and I told my husband, since I'm allergic to all these animals and stuff, can I at least have this? <laughs> he goes, looks like you already did. <laughs> so now he has a friend and a bear. And then I found, and I've already gotten into these and used them, there's a crown and wings and a bird, and a heart, and a fleur-de-lis, and a star, and I used the miniature crown already on a card that is with that flower, and then I found this, and when I saw this, I just about dropped my teeth. It was the only one they had. It is absolutely gorgeous. It, um, my daughter Elizabeth and her husband Kyle collect crosses and Kyle just had a birthday a couple days ago and hers is in about three days so this is going to be theirs on the front it says hope and that happens to be Elizabeth's middle name and I just was so tickled to find that for them and then oh I should show you this is the birthday cards for them there's the flower and there's the little crown that I used out of there. And then I wrote a verse for the inside. That's for Kyle. And then Elizabeth on the front of hers um, is All Hail the Power of Jesus Name in the music script. 
and this Victorian lady with lots of flowers and a beautiful stick pin. And then I also did the inside of hers and wrote a verse for her too. And then the favorite thing that I got, I don't even know if I can get this on camera. <laughs> it is so big. Can you even see? It's like burled wood in the pattern. And it is a big treasure box. I don't even know if that's going to show up. I collect boxes especially wooden boxes. So that one's staying here at my house. <laughs> we just had so much fun. Thanks again, Dee, for, for telling us about their sale that was going on. There's your answer, hon. <laughs> See you soon.